Hello to my friends, my ex-lovers. Today I'm going to show you a very realistic sanitary shave tutorial. Um, sanitary shave is something that I do on my, I don't really know if they're long or medium hair, but I do it to my cats because they get poop stuck in their back legs. They're disgusting little goblins um, and this help keeps them clean. So I just shave around their absolute, absolute business. I have tried to, oh, look, I'm showing you. I go out in all directions from said business. I did Fawcett first because Fawcett is mm, God's gift to earth. Um, she's so delicate and sweet and angel-like, and she doesn't really hate it as much as Coupon does. I do show Coupon in this video as well, but she, I mean, she goes down fighting, you know? Um, anyways here she is. I'm just shaving. I'm just doing my best. You know, I'm not an, I'm not incredible at this. I'm not a professional, but look at me, look at me. I'm trying so hard. Oh, once they get one arm out, you're done. You're done. Stop right there. So this is the main way I do it. I wrap them in a towel and then I set them on my lap and then I take their tail very, very, very gently and put it in between my legs. Um, look at me. I'm like trying to gear up to, to shave her a little bit more. It's so hard. It's terrible. And you got to do it in like little sections. Look at her. She's like baby Jesus, but better and more influential. And see, I see I didn't do a very good job. And I'm like, oh my God, we got to go round two. I was going to like mute the original video, but I think it's important to show you how much I sigh during this process. I've never been able to complete a sanitary shave just in one go. I always have to wrap them up. See, I place her tail so gently in between my knees and then shave around her business. Hold her back legs. But anyways, I've never been able to do it all in one go. If you can do a sanitary shave by yourself on your cat all in one go, I think maybe you should open up a business and do that professionally because, wow, maybe you're God's gift to cats and earth and etc. I don't use a guard on my clippers. Oh, I just got these clippers off of Amazon. I can link them. Um, and I'll show them up close right before I shave coupon. Prepare yourself for that. I was not prepared for that. I don't use a guard so I can get close to their um, business. Yeah, Fawcett and Coupon are neutered cats and so I have to shave over their little empty coin purses. It's horrible, wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. You have to be so like gentle and careful when you do this. And so you have to go slow and do it in good light. I do it in my bathroom so I can like close the door. It's a small space. Look at her. Look at her freshly shaped business. Ugh, she's stunning. I love her. Now I'm going to shave coupon. I'm showing you the towel I wrap them up in. Um, like I said, that's like my method one to wrap them up like this. Um, those are the clippers I use. Coupon, there's nothing on earth Coupon hates more than um, a sanitary shave. And she's going to show you. So here I kind of failed from the start. Like I didn't, I didn't get her wrapped up in a good way. Like it's way too loose. You see how loose it is? She's going to break out of that burrito so quickly. And she does. And she does. And, um, oh, she already has one arm out. Why didn't I stop there? Why didn't I stop there? Yeah, see, listen to her. She hates it. So I learned how to sanitary shave by watching YouTube tutorials, but the tutorials, the cats just sit perfectly still. I'm like, well, what are you supposed to do if you have a real cat and not a, you know, hyper-realistic robot cat, right? So this is what I do. Again, veterinary professionals will do this. They will just charge you money for it. I just don't want to pay money for it, you know? And it's not that bad. I mean, looking back at this video, like, look how sad I am. When I watch this back, I'm like, you know what? Maybe it is that bad. But me and her, we just needed, like, a little petting break. You know, and it, we just needed to... I look so forlorn. Oh, my God. But, yeah. I said realistic, right? I mean, I said realistic. So here I go, I wrap coupon in the third burrito. I will say I do think I got a better burrito. Um, third time's the charm. I mean, it was not in this situation, but you know, it might be for you. You know, you might have, you might have better luck or you might have a coupon and to that I say, Godspeed. So now I'm gonna move on to my second method that I do. 
Here I hold coupon tight to my body um, with my left arm. And then I use my left hand to lift up her tail and I use my right hand to shave. Um, I try really hard to keep her tucked into my body with my left arm. Um, and you're like, oh, are you successful? No, no, I'm dealing with coupons. So, you know, there's really no success. Uh, but I think it's important to hold them tightly no matter how you're doing this because you know a sanitary shave those clippers can can uh, injure their skin really easily you know if you're in doubt about whether or not you should do this then i don't know maybe have a vet do it i don't know i'm not in charge of you you know what i mean just like use your best judgment or something very close to that I have not wanted to make this video, even though it's been highly requested, um, because I know that people are gonna see how I do it. Look at me, I'm just like trying to have a heart to heart with her. I'm like, girl, we can do this. Like, And also, can I just say, to do it without a towel, that's psychotic. Like, what am I even thinking in this moment? Listen to that sigh, listen to her. But anyways, I haven't wanted to make this video. Look, even coupons, like, what are you doing here? My guy, my dude my friend because you know people people love to say I'm doing stuff wrong but look at that girl she's trying her best she really is or she's doing something that's close to her best you know at this point I say to myself hey look I'm gonna put her in one more burrito I'm gonna shave what I can and then I'm gonna let go and let God um and I did do like kind of a third method where I put her on the ground instead of the toilet seat and held her to my body with my left arm. Um, that was not any more successful. I think it would be better if I, oh my God, I love her, even though she's about to scratch the shit out of me. Ready, ready, it's about to happen. See, arm, arm, it's over for me. Anyways, I think it would be helpful if I had like a, a table that I could hold her to. But look, I don't have a table I can shave a cat on. And if you do, again, maybe open a business. Maybe do that professionally, you know? Anyways, I didn't do a good job of getting my third floor method on video, but that's okay because it wasn't that good. Here's her freshly shaved. But I hope this helped or entertained you. Love you. Bye.